Welcome to Mama's Kitchen. Today we're going to be making homemade coconut milk. Now coconut milk is a delicious beverage and it's a great replacement for dairy if you have sensitivities, especially for children because it's loaded with medium chain fatty acids, which are really easy to digest, as well as lauric acid, which is the same thing that's found in breast milk. Okay, so this recipe is pretty easy. All you're going to need to do is first climb a tree, pick a coconut, and then grab a hammer. Okay, wait, you don't live near the equator? Well, good, because neither do I. So I'm going to show you a way that you don't need to climb many trees. Um, and you're also not going to have to use a can opener because canned coconut milk will work in a pinch, but we really don't want to rely on canned foods because they're lined with PPAs, which are known to cause reproductive problems, cancers, and type 2 diabetes. So we want to keep those to a minimum. Okay, for this recipe, all you're going to need is organic, unsweetened, shredded coconut, and then filtered water. In terms of instruments, you're going to need a blender, um, a bowl, and then a strainer with some cheesecloth. Okay, so let's begin. So the first thing you want to do is measure out two cups of your coconut. We're going to put it right into the blender. And then we're going to heat up four cups of filtered water. Now, um, some recipes call for two to two, so two cups of hot water to two cups of coconut. I'm gonna make mine thinner because I really wanna use this as a drink, kind of a replacement for milk, so you can kind of play with your consistencies. Um, so here is my boiling water, and I'm just gonna start pouring it in. And I think I'll start with about three cups and then kind of see how it looks. Okay. So that's probably good. And then I'm gonna take my lid, close this guy up. Now be careful because this is piping hot. So use like a towel or something so you don't hurt yourself. And then we're gonna blend for 30 seconds. Okay, great. Um, so as I look in, it looks about a good consistency for me because there's some thickness to it, but there's also enough of a runniness that I can drink it easily. So what we're gonna do now is just let it sit for about 10 minutes. So I have my bowl here with my strainer, and then I'm just gonna take a piece of cheesecloth and line it. And then I'm gonna take my beverage here and just pour right on top of the cheesecloth. Okay. So now we're just gonna sit and wait and uh, just let it do its work. Okay, and you might wanna use a spoon or a spatula to kind of Mix your pulp around. This will just encourage the liquid to drop. Okay, so there you have it. Nutritious, delicious coconut milk and a lot better for you than canned. 